It's in there, man. Gentlemen, please come in. Thank you. Nice to see you, Maurice. Likewise, Peyton. Can I get you boys anything? I don't mind if I con the rocks. Help yourself. Peyton? No, thanks. I'm fine. How's Ann holding up? Well, she's tougher than you'd imagine. And the little fella? Well, he's withdrawn. I think she's going to get him some counseling. That's wise. Tough on a child. Tragedy like that. So, we need a candidate for the governor of the state, don't we, Tripp? Well, the beauty of it is, is that we won't have to throw out any of the bumper stickers. Because we're practically interchangeable. Now, that's not entirely true. Your brother was a skilled politician. You are a besotted jackass, henpicked with a blousy shrew with counterfeit buzz. Hey, 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 let's go easy here, Maurice. I'm sorry, Peyton, to be so blunt, but you know, I play tackle football. I'm aware. Look, the way I see it, I'm the most electable man in the party right now. I'm not worried you won't be elected. I'm worried once you are elected, you'll bollocks things up so badly the party will be out of favor for 12 years. You gotta give me the benefit of the doubt. No, I don't. You have to give me your assurance that I will set policy and approve all major appointments. Of course I'd be coming to you for advice. Not advice, consent. You do not act without my permission. That's the arrangement. That's the only deal on the table. Well, gee, I think I could live with that. No, you can't. Maurice, you will have the same level of influence you've always enjoyed, but you will not keep your foot on his neck. You need each other. And that is the position from which this bargain must be struck. All right, Peyton. Trip. I'm ready to shake hands with the next governor of the state of North Carolina. What do you say we have a drink on that? You've had your drink. We've got things that need our attention. That's fine. Take a day to mourn your brother. Tomorrow I'll put you with some handlers at 7. A.M. A.M. We need to be discreet. You and I will never be seen together in public. Okay. Your brother made an awful lot of political capital at the expense of my good name. Let's not squander that. Yes. And ease up on your drinking. You don't hold liquor like your brother. I do all right. Ease up. I'll see you tomorrow then. Hey, Maurice. 